I'm Letitia Pepper and I'm running for Ward 1 in the city of Riverside and I would like to talk to you about your experiences as one of the owners of a downtown business. Would you mind giving us your name and the name of your business please? Sure. Uh, my name is Maria Hernandez and I own Maria Santitz. I've been in the business here for 12 years and I love downtown Riverside. And so you've been in business in this location for 12 years? Yes, I am. And this location only for one year, but I was in Market Street for 12 years. And uh, have you noticed uh, how your business has been doing lately? Um, you really want to know that. <laughs> we are suffering. Uh, it's a lot of our customers are not satisfied. They're not happy. They're, they don't want to come to downtown because of the pain meters. That's the true reason. Now, you tell me something that indicates it's not just that they have to put money in the meters, but it's how they're also just treated. About someone who bought a table from you? Uh, yes, uh, this happened right in front of my store. I had a customer who bought a table. He paid the meter. And when we were loading the table in the truck, uh, he was getting a ticket. And I asked the the person who was giving the ticket why and he said because he used the wrong number he's supposed to use the number in the front of the car not in back of the car and I said well how are they supposed to know that and I said well would you understand he has a, a pay ticket and he used the number in the back he said no you have to talk to that to the city and I'm giving him a ticket the person said uh, I said, please, um, you can do something about that ticket. And he said, no, I just never will come back to downtown Riverside. So your customer said they wouldn't come back? Mm -mm, no. Uh, have you had that experience with other customers, that same kind of problem? At least with three people a week. They had problems with the parking. Uh, they tried to enjoy the day, which is dining and walking downtown, which is so beautiful, shopping, and they can't do that in two hours. Uh, well, why only two hours? I had no idea, <laughs> but that's what the meters are, two hours. So you, you mean you couldn't put in enough money to stay four hours? I believe they have to move the car to stay another two hours. Okay, I can see. I wouldn't like that. I'd need at least four hours to shop. Uh, is there anything else you'd like to say about your experience? I would like to say that this is the heart of the city, and it's beautiful, and we want people in this area. Our business is, 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 is so small, but we have beautiful stores, and uh, we want people back to downtown. Uh, I have to say, uh, I was in your store and you have beautiful things. If anybody wanted to find something unique as a, a wedding present or a special present for someone, you have beautiful things. Someone said it's sort of like being on Rodeo Drive, but right here in Riverside. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yes, we have wonderful stores around here. Thank you very much.